Jones to Kobayashi. Now it's space it. Out of nothing, Elbrex open up the scoring. It took 30 minutes for the game's first real chance. It took 30 minutes for the game's first real goal. It's Kan Kobayashi, the man with four assists. That's probably why Agba was up on his feet there. That was the first touch with his left foot, Kobayashi. And as soon as he got past Brunchevic, there was only one outcome. That first touch took it away from Brunchevic and that finish. Smartly done. Koga to come up with this. At the other end is Tanaka. Hangs one up. Hyrule does really well. Well, Elbrex could have and should have scored a second. It was Tanaka with the cross. As a shot from range. This is Omori. The keeper does well. There was a chance for the rebound, but both Elbrex players were deemed to be in an offside position. And I tell you what, Iro keeps them in the game. Darante swings one in. Well, the ball falls to Hoshino! And just like that, Balasia are back at it. Shuei Hoshino. Well, his absence was sorely felt last weekend. The first real quality ball delivered into the penalty area by Balestia from Darren. What a ball. Took it very early as well. And that finish. Look at this. Ujahari steps up to cut that out, but it falls to Tananari Lee. That's Sugita for company. It's Sugita on his left foot. And it's deflected onto the post there. Sugita coming ever so close to putting Elbrex back in front. Good counter here, Tainari Lee again with an, almost another assist. He was deflected off Darren Tay. Tavich marking Jun Kobayashi. Ball sent to the back post and it goes in. It trickles in actually. Off the head of Tadanari Lee. What looked like a free header. It's too easy, too easy if you're a Ballastia fan or official. This is Tadanari Lee, who has the last touch of the game and in fact had the last say of the game here at the Topayo Stadium. His header in the 86th minute has given Elbrex Nigata all three points. Uh, they look to put pressure on league leaders, Lions and the Sailors.